In this video, we will give a quick overview of the Manhole Automated Python Part, or App as we like to call them. The Manhole App is very versatile and can be used in many different situations. The App provides the ability to modify the geometry for the overall shape, including an eccentric or concentric top, different wall thicknesses, base slab geometry, and adding openings with different geometries. After the geometry is defined, we can then add all the required reinforcing and create sections automatically through inputs in the palette. To begin, we will go to the palette and choose the Library tab. The Manhole app can be found in the default Python Parts folder. Double left click to select the manhole. Once you've done this, you can see the app tools open in the palette, and this is where we can define the specifics of the manhole. First, we will look at the first tab, Geometry. This is where we can define the overall geometry of the manhole, such as the upper and lower diameters, wall thicknesses, the height, and where the splits in the height will be. The height splits can be determined by placing semicolons in between the heights of each piece. You can also determine the foundation slab size, whether the cone is eccentric or concentric, the amount and size of rings, the specifics of the joint geometry, and finally entering in the specifics about any openings in the manhole. These openings can be combined to make different shapes of openings as well. The next tab is for the reinforcement in the manhole. Here you can define the complete reinforcement for the manhole, including the cylinder reinforcement and foundation reinforcement and the hole covers. The Style tab defines the layers and line types the manhole will be brought in on. The last tab is the Views tab. Here you can determine if you want sections of the manhole to automatically appear, and if you have openings in the manhole, you can have OPlan automatically create a table of the openings in it. Once you place your app in the model, you can simply double click to get back into the properties and make any necessary changes. If for some reason the manhole app does not have something that is required, you can always get your part as close as you need and then turn it into a 3D element from the geometry tab and then make the necessary changes needed manually. But be aware, once you turn it into a 3D element, you cannot go back into the Python part and make the automatic changes. Also, 
Even though the manhole was created using our app, you can still create accurate schedules for your use. Now you can have fun creating and reinforcing your manhole using the intuitive manhole app.